best in the world. Hey, Daniel. How are you doing? It sucks. I'm coming. <laughs> Mushroom wants to go out. Don't you hear? Yeah, sorry. Move. So, what's going on? It doesn't fit in. There's too much stuff. It's fucking bullshit. What's your profanity? Okay, no more swearing. Sure. Like you're always polite. Come on, chill out. What did you pack in? What the f- Dude, you can't fit the whole room in. Don't worry. Your super strong big brother can help. <laughs> awesome. Thanks, Sean. Well, looks like we're almost set. Where's Mushroom? Still peeing, I guess? I'm gonna check what she's up to. <sighs> okay, I'll fill up our bottles and I'll catch up with you guys. Okay, all done. Where the hell is he? Daniel! Daniel! Hey, you out here? Daniel! Where is he? We have a two day walk ahead of us. Better get going. Daniel? Where are you? What the fuck happened here? Dude, what are you doing? That's not good. <sighs> Daniel? Fuck. 
Daniel. I'm so sorry. It just wouldn't have changed anything to kill it. I'm right here. It's all right. Here. You should do it. That's it? It's pointless. You can't even bury her. Well... Unless you want to say something. Uh, goodbye, Mushroom. You were such a good puppy. I'll always remember. Running through the snow with you. And how you... You snuggled. And... I'll never forget you. Never. Girl, rest in peace. You won't be forgotten. Sean, do you think she's up in heaven? With Dad? Yeah. I'm sure he will look after her. About his allergies. Don't worry, Inanna. There's no allergies up there. They'll be fine together. Okay. We should go. It's getting late. Okay. We didn't have to go. I like having a house again. Come on. Let's hit the road. What about my traps? Should we leave them up? <laughs> They'll protect the next runaways to stay here. I put both you in charge of the house mushroom. <laughs> so long. I've been running round in circles Chasing my tail and lost my way Seeking shelter in different corners Never finding a place to stay Somehow ended up here on the ground Brother, help me up, I've fallen down I know that I've hurt the ones that I hold dear The ones I love Thought that I would find the answers Drinking till my feet felt numb Just like father did when I was young I don't know how I could be so dumb I've been lost far too long I can't see I'm trapped in darkness Life has turned it back on me it seems Brother, help me up, I've fallen down Have you ever felt like someone who's meant to be somewhere else?
caught inside a state of mind where nothing is really making sense. That's why I've been left here on the ground. Sister, help me up. I've fallen down. I've been lost far too long. I can't see. I'm trapped in darkness. Life has turned its back on me. It would seem. I've fallen down. Brother, help me up. I've fallen down. <coughs> We made it, Daniel. It's been a long time since I was here. When was that? Before you were born. Come here. Let me check you out. Claire likes everything super clean. Dad said she got pissed because he let me bring a snowball in the house. We don't want to look like total pigs. What if they went on vacation? Or, or, or something? We'll figure out something. I'm sorry, we don't want any of... Hello, Claire. Sean? Oh, my. Is that... Daniel? What's going on out here? I heard... Look who's here! After all this time. What the hell are you doing here? Stephen, watch your mouth. Well... It's kind of a long story. <coughs> oh, you poor thing. You know he's sick, right? Oh, shit, Sherlock. <sighs> yeah, but... Okay, inside. Both of you. Hey, is it uh, warm enough for you? Oh, yeah. Feels nice and toasty. I gave Daniel some cough medicine. But you should have taken better care of him. He could have been worse. You were lucky. Stephen, may I talk to you for a second? So, how's the kid doing? He'll be fine. Just a little head cold. Oh, Stephen. It's good to be inside. Finally. I just hope they let us stay the night. <sighs> Fuck. Did I make a mistake coming here? Not sure it's a good idea. Yeah, we... I... Remember that. I think it used to be in the... Living room. <sighs> Feels so awkward to be here. Shit. I'm so hungry, my belly hurts. Are you all right, honey? 
You want more tea? Thanks. I'm good. Uh, well, Sean, uh, do you want to talk about... Uh, uh... The police called us a few weeks ago. They're looking for you as suspects in a homicide. Now, if you want us to help you, did you hurt that police officer in Seattle? No, that's fucking bullshit. I never touched the guy. No, don't, don't get mad, Sean, we have to ask. We only know what we saw in the news. All I know is that he shot dead. And now he's gone. Oh, sweetie. We are so sorry for what happened to your father, but why did you run away if you're innocent? I didn't want Daniel to see Dad. Like that. I felt like I had to protect him. I understand, but... You know the police would separate us. Maybe forever. Daniel would end up in foster care. Ah, you, you can't be sure, Sean. Anyway, at least you've managed to come here alive. We're glad you two are okay. I hate to think what could have happened to both of you. You need to think of long-term solutions now. I tried. I swear. But I can't do everything. So... What are your plans? <sighs> Go down to Mexico. To Puerto Lobos. Dad has a family house there. Sean. You can't run away from the law like, like fugitives. How can you look out for your brother if you're both running from the police? You two are gonna stay with us. Oh, Stephen. Maybe we should... After your mother left, your dad never really wanted us in your life. I can't blame him, but you're still part of our family, and uh, we want to prove it, okay? Seriously? That's really nice, Stephen. Thank you. Okay, but we have to lay down the rules of the house. No mess, no noise are no service. The biggest rule is keep your heads low around here. Beaver Creek is small and nosy and nosy. We can stay? Serious? Awesome! Ooh, Sean, guess what? There's a huge model train upstairs. Hey, you're supposed to be resting, young man. <laughs> yeah, yes he is. But he seems better already. Anyway, you and Daniel will stay here. At least until Daniel's better. We'll see what happens next. So, I bet you're hungry. Let me fix you something. How do you feel, Superwolf? Way better. It's nice and warm in here. And the food? Yum. Yeah. Feels good. Feeling better? You look cozy. Yeah. I'm not bad. Mm. Thanks, Grandma. Good. Your temperature is down. I'm way better now. You still need to take it easy. How about if we say a little prayer and, and give thanks? It's like a bedtime story. Right? Well, this is a bit like this, yes. 
Except the story comes from up there. <laughs> the ceiling. So are we ready to pray? Just follow my lead. Sure. We need all the help we can get. Can you ask the blessed dad? And Sean. Um, and Mushroom. And you and Grandpa. And, uh, everybody else. Oh my, you are so sweet. Thank you, Lord, for bringing Sean and Daniel safe and sound into our house. Take care of Esteban and, uh, Mushroom. Please give us the strength to get over the hardships of the past and the trials yet to come. Amen. 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 Okay, it's bedtime. Try to get some rest. You still need it. And no roughhousing in here. No worries. We're too tired. Good night. Oh, and thanks again. Good night, Grandma. Feels so nice to have a bed again. And the bathroom. I hear that. <laughs> Plus, you don't smell anymore. Whatever. Well, Claire seems pretty caring. And nice. I guess Steven is too. I hope we'll be fine here. I think so. And the more important thing is you'll have time to get better. Sean? Are we in Mom's old room? Nah, I don't think this is the one. Not from what I remember. But it's been a while. Could we check it out tomorrow? Maybe find some of her stuff? No way, Daniel. We didn't come here to dig into the past. But I want to see what kind of stuff she had. Just curious. <sighs> Daniel. She left us. She's gone. She's nothing. It's just us. You understand? Yeah. Uh, I guess. Hey, man. You've been doing so great with your... Well... You know. I was wondering... How do you do it? Uh... I don't know. I concentrate and... It just happens. So... It makes you feel strong? Like... Special and mighty? I don't think that. I don't know how I feel. Why are you asking? Never mind. Just curious. Forget I asked anything. Anyway, remember the rules, right? We really don't want Claire or Stephen to start asking questions. I know, I know. Don't show, don't talk. Just keep that in mind and everything should be fine. Sleep tight, little cub. I'm a million percent. That is better than a hundred percent.